What is up everybody and welcome back to my deck formula series for today again. This is Archangel1254 Jaylee Pritt here. Or aka Jaylee Pritt. I forgot to say that part. Anyway, like I said in the Weapon X video, I am now broadcasting to you guys Dragoonities. Which is a pretty good deck in my opinion, but they just got hit pretty hard with this format. So they're not as up from what I'm hearing, but people are attempting to make it better. Anyway, let's go over a deck profile that w could have been used for 2010 if anybody was crazy enough to pull it off. Starting off with the monsters, there's like 25 monsters, 11 spells, and 4 traps. But some of them need changed out because what was limited and what is limited. Anyway, to the monsters, we have 3 Dragoonity. For starting off with the Dragoonities, we have 3 Brandies, Brandy Stock, or however it's said. Three Ducks, three Legionary, three Militum, uh, three Phallix, uh, three Garuda, the Wind Spirit, one Gores, two Mist Valley Soldiers, one Morphing Jar, and three, and yes, they're actually what Red Eyes Darkness Dra Metal Dragon was up to three in 2010 and in 11, from what I heard. Anyway, that's over the monsters for the spells. We have one Book of Moon, one Dark Hole, one Foolish Burial, two MSTs, three Rising Air Current, and three Terraforming. Traps, one Bottomless, one Call of Haunted, Mirror Force, Toriental. Extra deck, we have two Ally of Justice Catastrophe, one Black Rose Dragon, one Bryonac, Dragon of the Ice Barrier, two Dragonity Knight, Gader Gadirg, or however you say it. Um... One Gabolg, G A E, um, two Tridents, one, or, yeah, one Bajuranda, I can't pronounce that name either, one Flame Veil Uriquizes, two Mist Worm, one Stardust Dragon, and one Thought Ruler Archfiend. Now to tell you guys how the deck works. Basically, you're basically wanting to mill out. This guy here, because so you can play Militum, he uses ability to take a level 3 or lower dragon type Dragonity monster from your graveyard and equip it to him. But Phallix has an effect where if he's equipped to a Dragonity card or equipped with any card, you can basically special summon him from the spell and trap card zone and basically use him as a tuner. Tune him with Phallix and get whatever. This deck is basically meant on spamming, swarming, and synchro summoning to get out the tougher monsters. Garuda, it's basically made in the same, same content, context, or contents, however you would say it. Remove a wind monster and special summon them. Like I said, this deck is built on spamming, swarming, and just dealing heavy damage. Mist Valley Soldier, he's the other high level tuner. And... Well, this deck really ain't that hard unless you know what you're doing. Morphing Jar, we already know what this does. Darkness Metal Dragon, just remove a... Basically, just throw down a dragon you're not going to be using or a spare dragon you have. And banish it and then special summon this guy. Whatever dragons you have in your hand or graveyard, you can use Darkness Metal Dragon's effect to special summon that <laughs> dragon or whatever dragon from your hand or graveyard straight to the field. So it's actually pretty op. Say, for instance, if you have Stardust or one of the Dragoonity sinks in this, and you could basically use Darkness Metal Dragon's effect to special summon one of them. And the main card to this deck is also uh, Gadir, because when he's Synchro Summoned, you can, or during once per turn, you can activate its effect, basically adding a Dragon type. Or winged beast type level 4 or lower mon mon monster from your deck to your hand in exchange you have to discard one card so that actually works well if you have Garuda in your hand and you sync um, ducks and phallix together and disc and you have them in the graveyard do whatever and you can special summon Garuda if you have them in your hand so that's actually another good trick to do and legionary if you have a Dragoonity equipped with them from the graveyard, you take a Dragoonity Dragon from your graveyard that's level 3 or lower and equip it to this guy, send it to the graveyard, you can basically destroy a spell and trap card zone and 
basically, oh no wait, you can destroy a face up monster in your opponent's control. And my fault, I misset, mispronounced that. Um, I haven't played them in a while, so that's why I was having a rough start. And Foolish Burial, same thing for Garuda, <laughs> Phallix, with Militum, or no wait, er, and Ducks. Militum, he just basically selects a Dragon type Mon Dragoonity card from the Spell and Trap card zone and special summons it. So, like, um, for, I forget most of their names. Crap, can't find it. It's the level one tuner. Oh, Brandy Stock, you can special summon him from the Spell and Trap card zone. And you could use him to tune with Ducks or Militum to get your Worm or Cataster. So, yeah. And very little traps. And the spells, pretty much you're searching out cards. This is pretty much a search, spam, and attack deck. Anyway, guys, that's the Dragoonity deck, deck formula for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys know the drill. Like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you thought. And please give me more deck suggestions. And this shout-out goes out to Jack. Thank you for suggesting this video for me to do, dude. Um, alright. I guess that ends with this video today. This is Archangel1254. Signing out, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying this. Later. Woo! And have a good day.